it's important to understand that when you add pagination in the front end, in WeWeb and in any other uh, tool really, uh, when you add pagination in the front end, the data is still being loaded in the browser. So even though you only see um, the five items here, for example, that we've paginated in our Airtable collection, if we open our um, our network here and find the API call, we can see the response to the API call and we can see we have the entire collection. And so the first five items are the same as we have on our table, on our page in WeWeb, but you see that we have many more. So if I take uh, this one, for example, mileage 428, um, we don't, have it here. It's not included here. So here, the reason for that is that I'm using an Airtable collection and the pagination comes after the fetch. So we fetch the data, we fetch all the data from Airtable and then we paginate it. Uh, that is uh, a front-end pagination filter. You can also do back-end pagination filters uh, with the Superbase plugin. You can do that natively. You can do it directly in WeWeb where you put the pagination before fetching the data. Uh, if you're using Xano, you can set up backend pagination on, on in Xano. And then in WeWeb, what you would do is you, would don't, you wouldn't have any additional pagination here. But on the paginator element, you could um, set up custom pagination to match the pagination you have in Xano. And we have dedicated documentation on... Uh, back in pagination so don't hesitate to have a look at that.